from your news leader. OJ Simpson is granted parole after serving nine years for a botched robbery. We asked people around Erie their thoughts about the decision. Young people in law enforcement meet face to face to have conversations. We'll hear what some of them have to say. Also tonight, a close call for some Erie veterans on their way to a ball game in Pittsburgh. Live in high definition from your news leader, this is Jet 24 Action News at 11. Good evening. O.J. Simpson is granted his freedom today after serving the minimum sentence nine years in connection with a 2007 robbery. He was originally sentenced to 33 years. Jet 24's Kristen Nielsen has our top story tonight at 11. Um, Mr. Simpson, I do vote to grant parole when eligible. An emotional Simpson appeared in court today via video from Lovelock Prison. Thank you. After serving nine years in a Nevada prison for an armed robbery that took place in Las Vegas, Simpson could be released as soon as October 1st. We asked people here in Erie their thoughts about the decision. What are your thoughts? Well, my thoughts is I would free him because, truthfully, you know what I mean, if somebody stole my Heisman Trophy, I'd go run and take it back, too. I think he did his time, you know, whatever. Even in the worst of times, life isn't over. So you have to, you know, you have to persevere. But at the same time, if you do get a second chance or a third chance, like, be good. I say a free him. Most of the people we talked to believe that Simpson did serve his time for the attempted armed robbery, while others think he should have been punished more harshly after apparently getting away with murder in the 90s. No. You deserve to sit a little longer. Think about what you did. Whether I believe he did it or not, mm, I still think he did it. And he already did nine years. I think that they locked him up because of the, the murder thing, you know what I mean? And I got, personally, I think it's stupid. That was like 40 years ago. It's 2017. Kristen Nielsen, Jet 24 Action News. The Youth Leadership Institute of Erie brings young people.